That's it. There you go, Z. Flex it. We're live. The gun show. The gun show is real, people. Oh, yes. Okay, oh. so guys, Sorry. I'm just going to talk you through phase three of the strong plan. <coughs> now we move into a bit more what I call bodybuilding strength. So we just take the focus off <coughs> trying to move around fast or um, higher reps. We, we put the focus more on trying to hit, I say, I say hit. We target the power lifts. We bring in more um, slower pace, really. So as you can see, I tried to explain that, but that came across really bad. But let's say on the guys, for example, so we now just have A1, A2, B1, B2, and so forth. They, the focus now is to try and push the weight, but then also to stress the muscle. It's got my little boy here, just doing a bit of a flex. That's it. Okay, so just ensure with this, guys, that you and all your coaches know how to regress exercises. That Back squat, obviously, make sure it's good quality, it's deep, it's good form. If they can't do it, don't let them just get away with it. Take them off it, pull them back, work on the mobility, whatever. All that, I would say, is fairly straightforward. So, again, I'm going to do it on the time thing. So, for example, A's, we have 12 minutes. So, then you have 8 reps and 8 to 10 reps. So, if someone really wants to push their strength, then obviously what we'll say is just maybe do 3 rounds in 12 minutes. If someone still is a bit more focused on the fat loss or the bodybuilding side we'll say well you know try and push four to five sets and um, so you can still make it really specific to your goals the only one here which you might be unsure of is a slingshot press up i'm going to use my model z so obviously we have the slingshot stuff in here but if you don't have that the easy alternative z band yes band yes yeah. we'll take that off so, so like, if you've got that use that for your press ups if you don't can use a mini band can't we this is how we set up without... Wrap, wrap this around uh... So we double up on the band. Twice. Loop it through, just Boom. all across the middle. And that yeah. still gives you a little bit of help at the bottom. So when you're pumping them out... Gives that same effect. It's a cheap slingshot, but it works. So that's that. Those will be both to failure. Uh, crock walks, rack carry sled rows. Crock walks might be the only one that you're unsure of there. Croc walks, so he's going to give a little demo. It's your ab exercise. So your feet on the sliders. Something that you may well need to regress or change depending on. Keep your body nice and straight. And you're just going to pull yourself along. Maybe 10 meters, 20 meters for the brave. So that'll be a length of that, a length of rat carries. And sled rows, which is dragging the sled. If okay, moving the, on. If you don't sliders people, what would you... Um, Recommend there? Is it more of a crawl? Is I'll it just, like... yeah, so I'll just walk. I'll just, so just, so just, just do it as a straight, yeah, straight yeah. arm. Straight arm and, and then just walk your feet. Okay, moving on. Uh, phase two, oh, sorry, day two. Everything again straightforward. Make sure we know how to teach a snatch. Make sure we have good quality movement. Meadow rows, see? Little demo with meadow rows. So we'll go from the front to the bars on the floor. We put plates on the end and then we just rep it out. So again, this here, the, the reps of this are not specified, just a failure. So we just pump it out. Come across the body. Yeah, come across. Um, weighted jump squats. Weighted jump squats, so we hold a weight in the goblet position. We don't really need to yeah. grab one, hold it in the goblet. Be a or a and obviously, bang, bang. Wednesday, we're sticking with the arm shoulder day. So this is just the midweek pump. Guys love it. Um, and here, because obviously we have the kit, if you don't have this kit, then it's literally just a shoulder and arm little pump. So, incline offset dumbbell curls. Do you want to get a little demo of that one? Yeah, yeah show. Sure. He's got the heavy weights here. Well, He'll never curl this much. So, so the offset? You just hold at the top of it. See where the hand is, yeah? Set it on an incline, start hammer, and rotate as we come up. Rotate to supinate as we come up. That's it. Straightforward. Body weight tricep extensions. See? I'm just going to show you with the high bar. The bin's over by in the kitchen. You might find yourself going a bit lower than this, my shoulders yeah. are a bit icky, so I tend to go quite high on this one. We we'll just dip under, push through. If it's too easy, then just drop the height. We'll superset them two with two banded stuff. So the banded stuff is just banded curls, banded push downs, and then a bit of a banded lat raise drop set. So for this, what we do is loop bands around your feet, and then you can use that as you do a lat raise. Day three, deadlifts, weighted chins, pull game, split squat, arm presses, 
inverted rows. Inverted rows are the ones where you pull, you use your body weight. Demos everyone, everyone know what an army press is? Come on here. Do you want to do me a little demo on yeah. that? Okay, let's do, let's do army press. Yeah. Army press. Just, just, just so you get to see it, you can see it done in different ways. Just go nice and light. Yeah, make sure you guys don't go too heavy on this. We're sitting down for that, yeah, so. And yeah, we'll stand up. Okay. Up and around. So we'll just get into. Go on then. Yeah. That's heavier than Z. What? <laughs> Superstar. <laughs> then in the. In the. In the. In the. Do it, do it straight legs a little bit harder so you're not twice as bad to spend the knees. Wonder arm or over. Let's go over. Over. So normally, most of you guys would be bent. Bar's a bit high there, but yeah, you get the drift. Yeah. Then we finish off. We've got easier bar extensions. Obviously, we have chains. If you don't, then just do easier bar extensions. And sandbag with this side drive. So that is the guys. Any questions, post below. Girls, front squats, chins, landmine RDLs. So set them up. So just put the bar on the floor. So landmine or the owls. Kind of hold it some yep. Hold it there so we load Wait, the bar up. Doing your RDLs there. <laughs> Nearly finished, mister. Yeah. Then we do a leg blitz on day one. The leg blitz is here as follows. There are. What? So we do heels, elevated goblet squat. Goblet squat pulse, which is. So you know, we go on a, bit, on a bigger plate, do a, yeah. on, on a 20k plate, but just for sake of argument. I'll probably set two plates up though. Yeah, a couple of plates up, a couple of tens up there, won't it? And then. So we do the bottom half of the goblet squat, 30 reps. Okay, nice. Girls are going to hate you after this, but they're also going to love you. So we do that, and then we do feet elevated dumbbell glute bridge with mini bands. So. It's actually been done. If you, have, if you have these mini bands again, if you don't have them, it's not a massive issue, is it? But, yeah, like so the slingshot, so Jonathan, your slingshot will do, yeah. or a small band, yeah. or a mini band, or a little band, you grab it around twice, pop the heat, feet in, and just literally either a bench or a box, if it's not too high, if you're just coming on there. Stick a dumbbell on your hips and dumbbell just there. it out, 30 reps, braced, Bulgarian split squats, all that is guys, is going to be holding onto a bit of support, so Z, can you reach that from there? I'll bring back in a little touch. This. Just enables them just to pump it out a little so bit just quicker. A... And they can hold one dumbbell in the other arm. Hold on, pump it. 20 reps, band hip hinge abduction. So that'll be again with the mini band around you. You don't need to put it on, so you just, yeah, just, just show the movements. So That's in the hip hinge, now. and it's just, see if he's moving his knees in and out. That will burn. And then we finish with frog pumps. We all know frog pumps? Probably not, no. If no, no, it's just like, like a glue bridge on the floor, which with the soles of feet. It's together. Dump it out. Perfect. And nice little squeeze. Okay, then we have deadlifts, rows, reverse couple of lunges off step, single kettlebell shoulder press. Make sure the shoulder, the kettlebell's in tight. Use their bar again. Kettlebell swings versus bands. So this is a advanced exercise. If you've got any new guys, don't let them do this. Um, start them just the basics. Kettlebell, the band goes around. See how he's doing it now. Yeah, I was going to say, I know we're going for way out. Here we go. And then, then back to that way. Yeah, so it, so it, so it ties on nice and. Oh shit, where was that? There we go. Two there. And it's tied on. There you go. Yeah, just so it doesn't, doesn't kind of come off you. Then all you do, put the feet through. Swing from there. And then we swing there. Perfect. Yeah. So they might need to back off on the weight of the bell because the idea is that the band's going to give you the added tension. They then have the same finish as the guys on, day, on the other day. And last one, barbell hip thrust versus mini band. Again, we put the mini band around the legs and we do the hip thrust. Dumbbell RDL, a high step up. We're talking about high step up, we're talking about a good height. Like. So over, over. Yeah. The knee's so going to be higher than the hip, isn't it, on that one there? We are way higher. Nice and flat and then yeah. drive through on about that height there. Because they won't be having. They won't have any. Um, so got, they won't be holding any, any, any weight with that, just for body weight. Shoulder blitz. That can be anything of your choice, but I'd probably say something like a lat raise, dumbbell front raise, rear delts, you know, just... Lats, fronts. Yeah, so just some sort of combo like that. 
And then we finish that with ball slams, split squat jumps, kettlebell swings, jump squats for their finisher. So guys, those are the next strong, fan, uh, strong phases for the guys. The key thing with this, I want to say is, is make sure you know how to regress exercises. Don't let people just dive into things which they can't do. Pull them back, don't be afraid to pull them back. Remember, you're the coach, you're the, you're the authority. And um, let's see how it goes down, all right? It's, Any questions? So, as I say, so in terms of progression, so like the guys say they, they, they want to go for bigger lifts, how are they going to progress over the next four weeks? Wow. Just explain oh, to, the, yeah. to the guys, like the girls, maybe they want to go for slightly heavier at the end of the next four weeks. How are they going to <coughs> they going to drop the reps down? Are they going to do less sets? So, is, is so all the reps and sets phase? are going to stay the same on this. So the aim is to kind of push yeah. the weight every week? Yeah, just push it every week. So cool. say if, for example, Z wants to get stronger, like I said, I would just say, right, his focus is to get three rounds in the 12 minutes on the first bit. So that means he'll be obviously hitting them hard, having longer rest. His week focus. Two, and then week two, I'm going to be. Yes, his bad. focus is going to be to add weight. Whereas someone who wants to maybe build muscle, their focus might be to add more reps. <coughs> okay. Something like that. Right, okay. So yeah. they can add reps, not add sets? Or... Well, sets, yeah. Sets, sets, sets slash okay. reps. Fine. Uh, but guys, any questions, post below this and tag me in it, alright? See you later. Peace out from Z.